That's uh, that's how that's how Rihanna got it on. I didn't know she could hit them notes there. I didn't know she could hit them notes there. Run that back for me, please, Riri. The power of the forehead has definitely not been stripped away. Like, people have been crying, begging, pleading for Rihanna to release new music. And what a more apt moment for her to answer the call than this one right here. The first single from the Black Panther Wakanda Forever soundtrack, Lift Me Up, written by Thames, performed by Bad Girl Riri. Let's see what's going on here. Mm -hmm. Just, just, just the first five seconds. I, it feels spiritual. It feels spiritual. I know in the Black Panther Wakanda forever, you can only take so much from the music, but I can just tell from the first five seconds, we are not even going to be crying. We're going to be weeping. We're going to be drowning in the puddles of our own tears. You know when black people start humming, it's going to be emotional. You you know that when you, when you start hearing the... Hmm, hmm, you know, oh, that sounded kind of, that sounded kind of hard. It's good. Ooh. She killed this. Ooh. That slaps, I can't lie, it slaps. It slaps. I can already see concert. I could see the phone lights out. The whole room is black. Just Rihanna on the stage. Massive arena. I can, I can see it. I can see it. People, the camera's going to pan to people crying in the crowd. I can see it. Again, if this is anything to go by, we are going to lose about 15 stone in our own body weight just from tears alone. Tissues are not going to be enough. I fear, I fear towels. Towels may be necessary. I'm thinking it, so I'm going to say it. Even though ugh, this is a great performance, as I expect from Rihanna, I would like to hear a Thames version. Needless to say, Black Panther Wakanda forever. I'm ready. <laughs> 